Hello, my name is Brandon, and welcome to Retro Reactions, a place where I experience amazing music from the 70s, 80s, and 90s for the very first time. And today we're going to be traveling all the way back to 1978 to listen to The Trees by Rush. This one comes from the album Hemispheres. It's been included on several top lists, so clearly it's a Rush favorite. Uh, the lyrics were inspired by a cartoon image of trees seen by Neil. Interesting. Always love their fantasy stories and to see how they're translated into lyrics and music. Anyway, if you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button as well as the notification bell to join the Retro Reactions community where it's all amazing music all the time. Here we go. There is unrest in the forest There is trouble with the trees For the maples want more sunlight And the oaks ignore their pleas The 
a really nice rush song here, a really nice journey. Of course, we start out very simple with that acoustic guitar intro, setting the mood. I love when songs start, you know, simple, quiet, uh, soft, and then just grow and grow into something else. Um, almost a folk feel in the music, and the biggest surprise here was Geddy Lee's vocals. He was very low in his register. It was a nice surprise, and um, he almost sounded like a different person. I've never really heard him that low. Maybe I have, but I just can't remember. But wow, really nice in his low, uh, really quiet or you know normal sounding register versus what I'm used to, which is you know high, high, really high and powerful. Of course, I love the bird sounds in the background to set the scene and the location in my mind really nice. Then, of course, the song ramps up. It grows 10 times with the classic, you know, Alex Lifeson electric guitar sound and Geddy Lee's high power vocals, which I just talked about. They joined the mix and everything went to a new level. You know, Rush, of course, are masters at peaks and valleys, and we get a few of them here in this song. Then around the one-third mark, everything changed again. I loved what I heard in that section. Definitely my favorite part of the song. We get these really cool temple blocks being played by Neil. Uh, this really nice synth solo. Very slow, very simple melody. And of course, the shimmering electric guitar arpeggios by Alex. Really enjoyed that. We even get this really big bass sound coming in. Again, simple melodies. I think those were the bass pedals. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that whole section was beautiful. And as we all know, Rush just keeps on giving in their songs. They give and then they give more. We get this signature Alex Lifeson electric guitar solo taking us to new heights. It was big, booming, didn't last too long, but always memorable. He's amazing. I also love all the percussion I heard in this song. You know, there were several instruments going on, not just the temple blocks and the normal drums. That's one reason I love Neil so much, his inclusion of these unusual percussion instruments within, you know, their typical rock songs. Really nice combination there. Just adds that extra special touch. Really enjoy that. A little surprising, the ending was pretty abrupt, but you know, they were at the end of their story. That's all that needed to be conveyed. Um, I love though the distant chimes and bird sounds, very, very distant to take us out of the song. Kind of a full circle thing. Definitely enjoyed that. All in all, a shorter but very satisfying musical story and journey by Rush. All right, really interesting lyrics here. I think it's a metaphorical struggle between the oak and maple trees within a forest. The oaks have outgrown the maples and are taking all the sunlight. Both groups of trees cannot understand each other's positions. In the end, the maples win, passing a law to keep all trees equal via hatchet, axe, and saw. Again, very metaphorical here. I think this equality uh, is a dream by many people for humanity, which may sadly never come true. All right, another really great Rush song. Everything they give, every song they give is a gift. I'm going to rate this one five golden records. Yes, an A slash A plus for The Trees by Rush, 1978. Thank you so much, Getty Lee, Alex Lifeson, and Neil Peart. All right, that's it for now. Thank you so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below if you wish to chat about this song. I would love your feedback. So you take care, stay safe, stay hydrated, and remember to let peace, calm, and light into your day and night. And I'll see you next time in the past.